Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this quick guide showing you how you can do the payphone missions in GTA Online, the contract DLC. Starting off, if you want to do these payphone missions, you have to own an agency. If you want to know how to acquire one and how the good stuff works, then be sure to check out the eye in the top right of your screen. In order to unlock the payphone missions, what you have to do is complete a total of three security contracts. In order to play security contracts, you have to make your way to the office, or if you've already done one security contract, you can then call Franklin and request one. It is my personal advice that you go to the office so you can select your own security contract for the simple reason that there is a mission that is called asset protection. This mission requires you to stand still for 10 minutes and kill a few enemies here and there. Not a very interesting mission at all and probably best to be avoided. So for that reason, try to pick something more fun or if you don't care, just call Franklin. After you have done these three security contracts, Franklin will give you a call as soon as you've done the third mission. Then you will have the ability to find a payphone around the map. Unfortunately, this is RNG, which requires you to then basically go around the entire map until you find the payphone. You will want to look out for the icon that looks like this. As soon as you get into the vicinity of the payphone, you will get this icon pop up on your minimap and or your map, and then you simply have to go there and then press the appropriate button to pick up the phone. Unfortunately, there's quite a few possible payphone locations on the map. On your screen, you can see how many there are, and obviously, I will be leaving a link in the description down below, as well as the pinned comment, so you can find that map for yourself and have a more static and better image. Luckily though, after you have found this payphone and you've completed the first mission, you'll then be able to call Franklin and just simply request one. He will then send you to the nearest payphone and then you can do yet another mission. There is however a 20 minute cooldown in between all of these missions and there's also some other cool things attached to it too. In these payphone hit missions, you will get a base payment of $15,000. However, if you were to meet the requirements of the special request from the client, you can get a bonus of $70,000, meaning that you can earn a total of $85,000 in relatively very little time. In my payphone mission, all I had to do was just run over the targets in any vehicle and I would get my $70,000 bonus. This could be in anything that I would like to use, like a bike or a car, or I could also add some extra flair to it and drop a deluxo on his forehead. Other than that, that really wraps it up for this video. If you enjoyed it or found it useful, make sure to leave the like, subscribe for more, and if you really like what you see on the channel, please do consider becoming a member like Chloe, Robert, Captain Price, Madman Dakota, and Shapeshift Gaming. Thank you again for watching, and I'll see you all later.